Now that we're back on the Unreliable, we're going to go check out Hawthorne's PC to see what he can tell us about these science weapons that we discovered. Because we got this uh, little mind control ray last time, so I'd like to get more of those if possible. So, let's look at messages from Alex Hawthorne. Um, unread messages? You fed first. Oh, I forgot to mention in my previous message. Silly me. I'm mailing you a copy of my favorite serial, The Space Adventures of Singularity Still. It's about a dashing space pirate with a heart of well still. It's not exactly board approved, so don't go showing it around or your space. Uh, no. Ah, we found the logs. I assume these are the science weapons because the first one is a shrink ray, then hammer power, then black market leads. So let's look at the shrink ray. Okay, we'll go through it. We'll go through that one. And we'll go through this one. There we go. And we should have those uh, missions ready to go. And looking at this, there's... Phineas has one of the weapons, and then one of them is on Groundbreaker. We'll have to go investigate that later. For now, we're going to go to the Ice Palace, or do the Ice Palace, which is where we go to the ship that Lilia found. So let's go. HRS 10... 84. A satellite in the outer parts of the Halcyon system. Heliospheric Research Station 1084 is technically owned by the board, but has long since has been long since abandoned. Wow, reading is hard. We've reached HRS-1084, Captain. It's emitting a very weak docking signal. I almost mislabeled it as normal etheric static. Well, let's get to it. Who are we taking? We should probably take these two just in case we need their skills. Ah, uh, no, we should probably take Vicar. We've made it to our space station. This is the place. We'll need the power generators back on to finish this job. Yes, we will, and that's why I brought you along, Vicar. You have great ideas. Well, that is not really restricted because you know this place is destroyed. Can't go through that door. Oh, there's still ammo around. Who would have thought? We're gonna switch to this shotgun, which we made a shock shotgun. Ooh, what's in here? Can we get into that room? Oh, we can get into the room. Nice. We like a nice safe, too. Give me all the goodies. Blank UDL card. That could be useful for something, right? I can program it. Can't do anything to that. Well, I guess we can't do anything in this room right now. What's up this ladder? A dead man. That's what's up here. Sorry, scientist. You poor guy. I hope you went out quick. Oh, you got a hunting rifle. Your computer is fried. Okay, nothing exciting there. Interesting. Uh-uh. Things will give me PTSD. Oh, come on, that shouldn't have hurt me. Well, I should have expected that one to happen that way. I guess I should really go turn the power on before I start exploring, huh? You can't hide from me, ammo box. I will find you. I will always find you. No, not always. But I will find you! Oh, that's a mine. Can I get back here? Will this hurt me? Nope, but it'll hurt both of them. Oops! Sorry, guys. I'm gonna kill them. Oops. Uh, hey, we got an identity card. Heck yeah! Is this stove on? That doesn't sound good. How's this place not burned down yet? Irresponsible. Gosh, I hate mines. Especially whenever that happens. Third time's the charm. There we go. What can we do with you? Modify generator mode. Normal. Continue. Maintenance logs. 
Repair toilet. <laughs> we repaired the toilet. Oh. Oh. I've activated your holographic shroud, Captain. Excellent. Becoming indistinguishable from an authentic UDL trooper will prove advantageous to your current situation. What's going on, Ada? A UDL vessel has been tracking our position and just recently docked with the station. They are patching into the station's transmission lines now. I cannot stop. I've been waiting for this day since we tagged your ship in Cascadia, Captain. I... Oh no. Wait, who are you? No one told me we had security forces deployed on the station already. Persuade. My team has already handled the situation, soldier. Your squad can report. Roger that. Just as a precaution, I'm sure you won't mind if we turn on the station's security systems. Can't be too careful. You don't need it! We hate to leave this location undefended after a close call with outlaws. I already reactivated the auto mix. Your readout must be on a delay. Hmm. That should have been fixed by now. As you say, we'll just head out then. Safe travels, soldier. Well, that was easy. The UDL gunship is undocking from the station. They appear to be departing into space. Yeah, because I have a silver tongue. That was rather impressive, Captain. Diplomacy at its finest. It doesn't really matter if our card works or not, right? There's no bad guys here anymore. At least there shouldn't be. I guess these robots will attack me. I kind of just want to kill them. Board reputation decrease. How do they know? Well, I guess I won't kill any more of those. It's going to decrease my reputation. It's the last thing we want. I want everyone to like me. Sharp eye out, Captain. One wrong step We're going in or kill. We could have just found the security card or we could just lock pick it. You know. Either option works. Disengage check for the security. Okay, what else can we do? I can turn it back on? I just want the experience. Owie. Owie. Now let's turn that off. Oops, why did I turn that on? I'm a big dumb dumb is what I am. Well, those bedrooms were useless. Nothing good at all. Oh, that is terrifying. Whoa. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Subjects will need extensive nuclear resequencing for any chance of viable extraction. I'm so sorry I ended up like this, James. We will come back for you and fix all this. I swear on it. James just got left. That's nuts. Poor guy. Ah. Oh, hey, it's the room that we uh, came in and shot bots up because I'm a bad person. Well, hello, computer. Can you help me today? Unlock personal quarters. Yeah! We like that experience. Let me in, please. Thank you very much. Oh, and a free safe? Oh, the little joys of this game. The little joys. Wait, what did I not do to the computer? Ah, there we go. Now I got it. Hey. Oh, my pick. We've 
granted sublight access to the station. Hopefully I'm ha re handsomely rewarded. Captain, I wish to offer my commendations for convincing the UDL's gunship to leave HRS-1084. I did not favor the idea of being stripped and sold for parts. I'm here to protect you. Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? See you soon, Captain. Let's go back to the Groundbreaker! We're coming for you, Miss Lilia. And up here! Stop it! Hello, Lilia. Finally, a base of our own. Soon we'll have eyes on every corner of the system. I want part well of this done, company. Captain. Give me percent of ownership. You'll also find some automatic salvage awaiting new owners. I'll have those dismantled. You can never be too careful when moving into someone else's territory. Better to be safe than sorry. Aside huh? from the automated security, did you meet any resistance at the station? I did. The UDL gunship both the station, but I convinced them to back off. <sighs> I knew it. They've been shadowing us since Monarch, maybe even longer. I've been less than honest with you. Your assignments weren't strictly about the salvage business. You don't We've say! I figured that out already. I'm listening. After the Monarch job, I started connecting the dots. I didn't like the picture. Then what we found at Station 1084 confirmed my fears. You and I have stumbled onto something big. Something none of us were meant to know. What is it? Bad news, I take it? Maybe the worst. Ask yourself why a skeleton crew was studying that Alta Vitae gas in secret. Ask yourself why stockpiles were hidden on a planet full of monsters. Research. I'm guessing you have an idea. Before we go any further, I want you to keep an open mind. Can you do that for me, Captain? Absolutely. I can do that. Aliens. I'm talking about aliens. They're the ones responsible for the deaths at 1084, and who knows what else. Aliens! We have to put thinking. a stop to it. Okay. Aliens. I'm saying it's aliens. I'm not asking you to like it. I'm not even asking you to believe it. But I need to act on this threat to the colony, and I can't do it alone. I'm here to Captain, go. in my I'm humble assessment, Ms. Hagen is insane. I want to go hunt aliens. This doesn't feel at all right, Captain. I don't care. I want to go hunt. The crew hunt. is skeptical. That's good. I don't want you walking into the unknown with blindfolds on. I assume you have questions. A few. If we're going to see this through, I'll need your trust and commitment. Now's the time for setting doubts aside. Yeah, okay, they're gone. When you say aliens, what are you talking about here, though? Conspiracy. One carried out with the help of human collaborators. Assuming they haven't all been replaced. This is an invasion of our very cells. That damned gas is mixing our nucleon with halcyon biology to twist us, change us. Make us more like those monsters on Monarch. That sounds terrifying. <laughs> Little green bastards must pay. Terrific. That go-getter initiative will carry you far in sublight. How do you know I'm not an alien spy on a mission to silence you? Sharing my findings took a calculated risk. If you were a spy, I doubt you'd even realize it. Only your cells would know. She does sound kind of crazy. Well, that's comforting. Probably nothing to worry about, as long as you don't start growing tentacles or slowing down time. <laughs> I do slow down time. You know, tell me what needs to be done. Dr. Chartrand is the crooked psychopath behind the gas experiments. She sold out her species. Now I need you to put a bullet through her skull. I'll just talk to her. Sounds messy, but I'll take the job. Messy or merciless? This key card will get you through the front door of her Byzantium estate. Don't ask how I got it. You might not like the answer. By now, the other side knows what you're doing. Don't trust anything Chartrand says. She's compromised down to the bone. Maybe even deeper than that. What if Lily is the real alien?